Uh, hello once again everybody i've got just another quick update for you for uh, the next week coming ahead so uh we're into may now hope everybody's enjoyed a nice beautiful weather weekend it's been great outside get outside and enjoy some good weather um it is may as just general news and info this week we have may crowning going on as well uh something it's a, certainly a tradition we enjoy uh each year and uh we will have have it live streamed for the fifth graders uh, as we've kind of done a few times um but we'll have that going on uh friday <clears throat> we've got the penny fair light going on which is something exciting that pta's um put in place now the weather's nicer we're going to do a sort of outdoors penny fair and uh thanks to pta for that i'm sure they sent home some info uh for families to kind of be aware of kind of fun things we're going to be trying to do in a safe way uh at the end of this week uh as far as classes going on this week just again real quick we're looking at uh, special cases for fractions this week um <clears throat> adding and subtracting mixed numbers and subtractions we need to do some renaming with the fractions um, which is a little bit of a extra step of difficulty or complexity uh, to the problems the kids as, as usual have done a nice job getting ready for it and getting into the basic ideas of in this case adding and subtracting fractions we're moving along pretty well and uh, looking to get deeper and deeper into those skills and building up all those abilities uh, as we continue toward the end of the year and science we're gonna i think take maybe one or two more days just some, for some end of the unit things on um, ecosystems and some fun, fun little exploratory items. Um, and then we'll get into energy, talking about forms of energy. Uh, here's a little, this, pa this little page has a little preview of some of those types of energy. Uh, we'll talk about what energy is, what work is, and how we create or generate energy and use energy and uh, transfer energy and all kinds of things. So it's a little switched from, we've just spent a lot of time on life science, uh, but like all things in science that we've learned about this year, it's all sort of connected and related. So there's definitely energy in nature. We've talked about food webs and energy, which would be like a form of chemical energy, like food energy. Um, but we'll also talk about other kinds of energy um, as our next little place to dive into with science. And finally, English. Uh, so we're continuing the personal narrative. We watch a few uh, videos to kind of go slowly through uh, creating and crafting some key parts of the uh, of the narratives we work on, including uh, getting our our readers' attention with a good introduction and using a using some good uh, uh, tips and pointers for a good conclusion as well. So we're now to the point of uh, getting into rough drafts and revising those rough drafts. And hopefully we'll get some time to start typing that final draft up. But again, it's something we've uh, been taking our time through this time around to really work on that writing process, uh, the early, early stages of it. And now we're kind of getting toward the end. So a lot of good introductions. I was actually really impressed with how well the kids use the uh, information in the videos for that one and uh, created their own sort of introduction, again, that kind of hooks the reader. And uh, we'll, we'll continue with that. So we're coming close to the end on that. Um, that's really it for now. Um, so we got a few fun things planned for the end of the week. So let's make it make it off, get off to a great start at the beginning and get some good learning done. And then uh, we'll definitely get ready to enjoy that Friday uh, penny fair. So yay for that. I uh, hope everybody else has a great week at home and other ways. And I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.